And for that girl backstage, may make it publicly clear. Never mind who you thought I was. I'm Rick James, bitch. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boy. Um, does that give me the right to attack you, to ambush you? I think it was cowardly. I think it was uh, opportunistic. Um, but again, I'm not mad because I know that in the street, um, uh, there's no rules. You can't, um, you can't blame them. They, they saw an opportunity and they took it. Um, so do you think that they went there intentionally to attack you, attack you, or was it a, a crime of opportunity? Um, a little bit of both. I mean, you know, uh, if you see the timestamps that I'm pretty sure, um, they have documented out. They arrived to the gym 10 minutes after I arrived. So, and they didn't make a, you know, when you go to the gym, the sauna, I'm in the sauna. You can't see who's in the sauna. So my immediate exit from the sauna, they knew I was there, it was calculated. And um, that's why I say that, that uh, it's, it's a little bit of both. What do you say to those who say that uh, you're a snitch for testifying? And um, would you do anything differently? No, I wouldn't do anything differently. I feel like the people, again, it's just people full of hate that doesn't know the real story. Uh, um, when you look at all the facts and the documents and the, and the transcripts of, um, of, of my court case, and you see um, the so-called friends and um, um, the people that I surrounded myself with, uh, they have this code, a street code, uh, a, uh, rules right that a code that they follow which means uh loyalty respect integrity principles you stand on right who broke the street codes and the street rules were them first you you haven't had security in the past two couple years. two years you didn't feel the need to have security no okay so now do you feel as though you need to have security no i mean no does um, anything change for you no nothing changes at all Nothing changed.